What if finding cancer in people was as simple as a blood test? An existing test just gives a cell count. It doesn't capture whole cells that doctors can analyze to choose treatments. Now, healthcare giant Johnson and Johnson is putting its corporate weight behind a Massachusetts General Hospital test that is far more detailed. We all recognize that uh, the current tools that we have are not that exact, and no matter what we try to do to predict how someone may do, um, we're not always right. So we're all clamoring for tools that will help us to improve identifying patients who need treatment or who can finish treatment earlier, or do we need to be more aggressive in treatment, or is this never going to come back? The new test could enable doctors to quickly tell if treatments are working for patients a process that can now take a couple of months using CT scans. Mass General is monitoring patients without painful biopsies. It can be done using a simple tube of blood. Most patients who have metastatic cancer are either treated based on characteristics of their primary tumor, which may have been taken 10, 15 years earlier, or they try and do a biopsy, which is not always successful. Veridex, a subsidiary of J&J, &J, says this method is the most promising of several dozen that companies and universities are rushing to develop in order to capture circulating tumor cells. Ultimately, the test may offer a way to screen for cancers besides the mammograms, colonoscopies, and other less-than-ideal methods used now. We are hopeful, uh, but we want to be cautionary. There are some things about this research that are really groundbreaking and could be incredibly helpful, but they need to be evaluated cautiously and in a scientific way. Four cancer centers will start using the test this year to help evaluate its effectiveness. Ross Simpson, The Associated Press.